For a delicate position like that, where loyalty, faithfulness, and the capacity is required, we felt that Honorable Faleke, you know, exceed any of them in qualities that that post demand. Moreover, we look at it that Nigeria is a multi-religious country. And uh, there are a lot of noise about Muslim Muslim tickets. So it will not be in interest of religious harmony for another Muslim to be a chief of staff. The Christian we want to know that their own person is in the inner caucus of government of our president elect Ahmed Tinumbu. Therefore, who do Christians in Nigeria really trust in? Our research has shown clearly that it's honorable Faliki. And this will bring the Christian to trust in the president elect that he have them in mind. Truly, truly, is not out to be to to relegate any religion to non-essential in the power structure of Nigeria. And therefore we are appealing to the president elect and all the power brokers across the country that Faleke is the choice of the masses. We the city boy ambassador throughout Nigeria, especially Ogun State and Lagos State. We believe in uh, Honorable James Abiyonu Faleke to be the next chief of staff to the president-elect come May 29 and above. In this perspective, we also believe that uh, Honorable James Abiyonu Faleke is capable, strong belief and honesty and trustworthy to be the chief of staff to the president-elect. Because there's a lot of antecedents in the past. Coming to Lagos, under his uh, former local government, we are in his well. He did a lot of things. Even coming to where he's living at the Jodu Grammar School. Getting there, nobody can say Honorable Faleke is not somebody that not to be trusted.